Hello, everyone. Hello, hello. Hello, sir. Hello, teacher. Hello, it's good to see you all today. How are you, everyone? Fine. Fine, that's fine. Hello, <laughs> hello. Hello. Hey, hello. Um, what's new? Tell me what's new. Is there anything new? Oh my God. <laughs> There's something new. Oh, no. There is nothing new. <laughs> nothing new? The same. The same? No, nothing. So how was work? How was work today? Um, well, a little calm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Good, good. Mm, nice. That's very nice. Okay. Um, we have one minute to go. Uh, we're going to wait for your classmates. Hopefully, hopefully they're going to join us in a couple of seconds, I believe. Okay. Okay. Great. All right. All right. Okay, let's wait just for a little bit and then we are going to start. Okay, let me see. January and 25, 25th. Right. Okay. So um, so what's new? Nothing new, just nothing new. Christian, how are you, Christian? Eunice. Hi. Good evening. Hi. Diego. Hi, Eunice. How are you? Mm -hmm. So, uh, what Good. happened yesterday, Christian? You didn't participate yesterday. What happened? I had a problem with my with my internet. That's why. Ah, okay, okay. I disconnect with if you not. Like oh, okay. okay. Hi. Good night. Good night. Good evening, everyone. So, how are you? Good evening. Good. Okay, nice. <clears throat> okay, uh, it's eight o'clock. Uh, it's a great time. It's a great time to start. So yes. welcome, Janet. Welcome, Sandra, Bafilia, uh, Eunice, Diego, Marjorie, Joaquin, Eduardo, Christian, Judith, Giovanni, Adriana, and Patricia Marroquin. Okay, so it's good to see you today. Um, how are you today? How was your day? How was your day? Tired. Tired? I'm very tired. Okay. Why? 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 What do you do? I had classes the whole day. <clears throat> okay. So do you, do you have classes online or in person? Online. I would like to be a person. So. Oh, okay. Okay. Welcome, Violeta. Welcome. Adriana, welcome. Okay, welcome, welcome everyone. Okay, so uh, it's good to see you one more time. Today is, what day is today, by the way? I don't remember. Tuesday. <laughs> okay, today is Tuesday. <laughs> Yesterday was Monday and tomorrow will be Wednesday. All right, I don't know you, but I have felt like this month, January, it's like forever. It's like, I don't know, like if the month has... 100 days. I don't know. Do you feel it like that? No. No? It is short. I feel it, it is shorter than last year. Nah, not really. I don't think so. But uh, yeah, yeah, it depends. It depends on what you're doing or if you're expecting for something great to happen. Probably I feel like it's forever. But if you're doing something that, it, that you wish you could have more time, Definitely, yeah. it passes away really, really okay. quickly. All right, okay. so I'm going to uh, share my screen. <clears throat> okay. All right, so today we are, as you know, wow, this is short, please. Okay, give me a second. Okay, there you go. All right, wow, this is, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Houses versus apartments. Yeah. There it goes. Okay, so. Today, we're going to be talking about houses versus apartment. You know, um, yesterday, we were talking about what? What were we talking about yesterday? About house. Okay, house, your house. You were describing your house. Okay, yeah. so this is the agenda, the agenda that I have for you. Can you see my agenda? Yeah, can you? 
Yes. Yes, yes, okay. yes um, teacher. Yes, okay, I do. good. So the main topic, uh, the main topic is going to be house versus apartments, and also we're going to be working on comparisons. Comparison. Okay, comparing two things, comparing houses and apartments, how different or how similar they are. All right. Okay, what is the main objective of today? Listen. Okay, the objective that I have for you today is by the end of the class, a student will practice what? Using adjectives and nouns to express comparisons in English. In this lesson, practice comparing housing and apartments to express similarities or differences, okay? So that's the main topic. We're gonna be describing and um, comparing houses and apartments, how similar or how different they are. All right. Okay. So let's review. Uh, let's review um, the topic that we talked yesterday. I want one or two volunteer, one or two volunteers, to tell me what we worked on yesterday. What do you learn last? Uh, well, I'm sorry, there is a mistake over there. What do you learn yesterday? My bad, my bad. Okay. So, what do you learn yesterday? Hmm? Uh, me, sir. Yes. Uh, well, yesterday we learned uh, many adjectives to describe uh, an, a house. Okay. Mm -hmm. For example, bigger, uh, huge. Uh, comfortable, expensive, cheaper, uh, adjective like that. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. Thank you. Uh, next, um, who else? Who can tell me more? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Me, teacher. Yes. We played category games. In oh, gaming yeah. We played category games. Yes, definitely. We played. Yeah. The category. And I was baited in Bateada. <laughs> beat it. Beat it. I was beat it. Yeah. Beat it or beat it. Uh, beat it. Uh, yeah. Okay. Can anybody can anyone tell me the differences sure. between yes? Uh, we learn the subject uh, to enough. Yes, definitely. We worked on the differences between two and enough. And we were working on um, some exercises. So can anyone tell me one exercise? Who can tell me an exercise? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. An exercise with either two or, uh, or enough. Uh, my car is, is uh, big enough for children. Okay, my car is big enough for my children. All right. Yeah, yesterday we worked on those exercises. Can anyone else give me another example? Me, teacher. Yes, Joaquin. Mm -hmm. My house is big enough, uh, cozy, for me, cozy for me. Okay. For my family. Can you say it one more time, Joaquin? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. My house is. Uh, is is enough cozy for my family hmm okay do you remember that yesterday before uh before we left i gave you one clue uh where it goes first enough or the adjective can you tell me can you remember that can anyone help me out what goes first the word enough or the word or, or the adjective what the goes adjective the, first. the adjective, the adjective, first. adjective first. first? So the adjective can first. you change that, Joaquin? How, how can you change that? If the adjective goes before, my house is big enough. Oh, okay. Okay. It's big enough. My mm. house is big enough to my family. Okay. To my so family. Oración, okay, Joaquin, so oración fue. My house is enough cozy, something like that, right? That's your that's your yes. question. Okay, that's your sentence. Yes. So remember, the word enough goes after the adjective. So okay. how would it be? ¿Cómo sería entonces, Joaquín? Si va después del adjetivo. Mm -hmm. 
<clears throat> my house. My, my house is is cozy for my family. Cozy enough for my family. Good. Good cozy job. For yes. My yeah. Cozy enough for my family. Good. Thank you, Hawking. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. okay. Anyone else? Anyone else? Mm -hmm. Adriana, welcome. Mm -hmm. Adriana, were you here yesterday, Adriana? Yes. Oh, really? Maybe your camera was off. Probably. Yeah, that's right. Ah, okay. Okay. So, um, can you tell me one sentence using either two or enough? My house is bigger enough so my family. <laughs> my house is big enough for my family. Okay. Okay. Good. All right. So, because of the time, we're going to move on to the next activity. Thank you so much for your participation. Okay. Uh, have you ever played this game, which, uh, which, uh, where you need to write down three sentences, two true and one false? Have you ever played that game? No. 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 Okay. Good. Okay. Good. So, I would like you to write three sentences. Okay, three sentences about you. Two are going to be true, and one is going to be false. Okay. Okay. So, okay. Look at my example. Look at my example. I'm going to give you my example. And then later you are going to tell me which sentence about me. It's false. Look, look at the first one. I have visited five countries. That's the first one. Do not tell me either it's true or false. Okay. I have visited five countries. I go running before I go. I go to work. And the last one, uh, I have practiced skydiving before. All right. So those are my sentences. Now is your turn. Write down three sentences about you. Okay. Vamos. Okay. Uh, en su cuaderno puede ser, o, o I don't know where. Mm -hmm. Okay. Maybe in a piece of paper that you have, escriben tres oraciones about you. Remember, those true and one false. Okay. If you got to look for, I mean, if you want to have a really um, very difficult to guess sentences, go ahead. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, let me know when uh, okay. when you are done. Yes? Okay, Sandra Ramirez, uh, it's, it's done. Who else? Who else? Me. Who is me? Me? Who is me? Janet. Ah, okay. Okay, Janet. Who else? Me. Who is me? <laughs> Adriana. Okay, Adriana, good. Mm -hmm. Who else? Eunice. Eunice, good. Eunice, who else? Yes. Who else? Son tres oraciones. Dos verdaderas y una falsa sí. about you. Who is me? Who, who? Uh, Marjorie. Marjorie. Okay. And Christian Osorio as well? Christian? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you, who else? Eunice, done, right? Okay, uh, Adriana? Yes. Adriana? Yes? Okay, good. Let me see, Joaquin? Joaquin? Okay, good. Basilia? Basilia? Finish. Okay, good. Patricia Marroquín? Patricia? Ya. Yeah. Okay, good. Yes, okay. I guess everyone, uh, Diego Arturo, Diego, are you here, Diego? Diego? No, a que me yeah. preguntaron si ya había terminado. Yes, ah. <laughs> Okay, good. Uh, Ricardo, yes, Ricardo, Giovanni? Uh, yes, 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 almost. I, okay. I finished it. Okay, good. In the meantime, while you finished, okay, can you tell me 
Which one is true and which one is false? Number one, who think, uh, can you go to the chat and type the one that you think is false? Vayan al chat y adivinen cuál de esa es falsa. Uh, okay. Number three. Let me see. Okay, number three. Okay. Auction three, 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 three. Uh, for me, three. Okay. Number two. Okay. Violet uh -huh. is the one who says number two. Oh, Diego, two, two, Judith, three, Rosa Maria, two. <laughs> okay. Okay, uh, let's go, let's see. Well, I'm going to start with number three. Uh, number three is true. It's true. Yes, yes, number number three is true. I did it, I done it before, okay? In Hawaii? Was, no, not in Hawaii, but it was in, um, in New York, in New York. Okay, so I might, Maybe next time I might show the video because I had the video with my GoPro camera. You can watch the video, okay? But that's gonna be later, right? Um, okay, please. Okay, please. okay. Number number two. Okay, let's go with number two. I go running before I go to work. Well, that is true. True. That is true. Yes, I go to work. I mean, I go running before I go to work. Okay. <laughs> So, number one is false. Number one is false. Why? Because um, I have visited around 11 countries. So, number one is false. Oh. Okay. Yes. Yeah. I, I guess I told you the first day. Wow. Which, which country? Uh, uh, country? I've been to uh, Spain. Italy, Germany, Austria, UK. Uh, let me see the other one. Mm. Let me see the other ones over there. Oh, Czechoslovakia. Czechoslovakia. Also, wow. I've been to the US. I've been to Peru. So I've been to Honduras. I've been to Guatemala and El Salvador. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ahí humildemente. No, I've been studying. I've been studying. Okay. I haven't been like, you know, really? hey, having fun. No, no, no. I've been studying. Okay. Yeah. All right. So what we're gonna be doing to today, we are gonna be working in small groups, a small group of three or four uh, members, right? And you are going to be sharing what? Sharing your sentences. Okay. All right. All right. So y van a adivinar quién en su grupo quién está diciendo la verdad o cuál es la oración que está en verdad, ¿ok? O es la, let me see, six, ok, good. What are you going to do? You're going to go to the small rooms and then you're going to read your sentences and your classmates are going to identify the sentence that is not true, ¿ok? Yes. Ok. All right, teacher. Ok, Ready. here we go. Okay, go to your rooms, please. Elsie, Ricardo, Giovanni, and Patricia. Can you go to your rooms? Thank you. Ricardo, Elsie, and Patricia. Hello, hello, Ricardo, Elsie, and Patricia. All right, the second. Second. You, you had uh, another two sentences, partner?
Okay, if not, you uh, can continue. Okay. You can continue, okay, the next one, because time is running, okay? All right. Uh, my, two, my three sentences are, I have studied computer repair. Uh, the second is, I don't drink coffee. And the number three is, I study a German. Which one of that is false? I will repeat. I have studied computer repair. I don't, the second is, I don't drink coffee. And the three is, I study a German. Which one of that is false? Oh, too many cars? Yes, cars. Okay. Oh, let me tell you what's the false. I believe that the number two? I believe the one. Ah, uh, yeah, the first. Number. The number. First. <laughs> yeah, the number, number one. Years. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, Luis. And um, I have read two books this month. I started English. Okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> voy a leerle la mía. I have two children. Okay. I finished my universe car and I practice, practice several sports. Mm. I play. And the number three, uh, the number three is I can't swim. Mm. I think the false is the second. The second. Okay. Me too. Yeah. Me too. I want I want to, to, to learn, but I know. It's a wish. It's a wish. <laughs> well, Joaquin, go ahead. It's your okay. Um number one, I have to work yesterday. Hello, hello. How's everything here? Judith, everything is yes. good? Yes. Yes, yes. Yes, teacher. Do you yes, finish? We finish. We really? finish. Really? Yes. Okay. Yes. So you're super fast. Yes. Okay. Uh, okay, okay, okay. I hope you had a great time learning about your classmates. Uh, I, I, I could hear many of you laughing at, at your classmates' guesses. And if you were enjoying with a coffee, that was much better, right, Sandra? <laughs> or tea. Okay. No, but um, thank you for participating. All right. So um, what do you learn from your classmates? Tell me something that you didn't know about your classmates, but now you do know about your classmates. Something that was like, really? I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. Sandra Ramirez speaks five languages. What? Really, Sandra? How many languages do you speak? Well, I, I try to speak five languages. Which are they? Um, German, French, Italian, and English. Yeah, well, I'm learning English, of course. Oh, okay. And Spanish. I wish I could say, okay, I wish I could say I speak uh, Italian because I mm, I barely speak a little bit of Italian. Oh, yeah, maybe, that's maybe, nice. Yeah, but uh, maybe another time we can have a conversation here and then we yeah, can. Yeah, we can, too, we can, of course. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. Yeah, I, I like, I, I like Italian. the Italian, too. Oh, Ricardo, I, too. Love, uh, I would like to hear you. Oh, okay, uh, Sandra. Okay, I, remember, hmm? I remember. I um, remember ten I years ago I took a lesson on Italian for a month. Oh, okay. But I don't remember anything about that. 
Okay, it's a little confusing. But though. it's a very nice language. Yeah, it's very kind of love. It's like the French language. Yeah, even though uh, it's Hello. basically it's like Goro, so it's kind of hard to pronounce uh, the French sí, language. Bien, Goro. Goro. Oh, no, like, French, bonjour, yeah. So bonjour, something like that. I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh -huh. Okay, we but French yeah. is my uh, it's more difficult. Yeah, because of the sound. Okay, what else do you learn from your classmates? Okay, what what else? What else do you learn from your classmates? Um, Adriana uh, studied uh, international relationships. Oh, nice, Adriana, nice. You wanna be a president? You wanna be a Congresswoman. Ambassador. An ambassador. I hope so. Oh, good. Good. Yeah, yeah. Don't forget about us, okay? When they, when you get the, the position, don't forget about us, okay? Especially if you want to get a visa or, or anything, let's go to Adriana. I hope to go to Korea or China. Oh, my ah, God. The okay. country, I hope so. Okay, good, good. Thank you. Uh, who I else? Uh, what when else? I wanna, when I would like to travel. <laughs> Okay, what else do you learn from your classmates? What else? Yes? Well, what else? Sandra, born uh -huh. in Panama, I think. Oh, yeah. She said who? that. Yes. Who, who, who? Sandra. Sandra? <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. So you are yes, Panamanian. You are Panamanian. I was, I, yes, I was, I went, of, of course, I was born in, in Panama, but I grew up in Panama. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. In my so, group? <laughs> yes, Marjorie? In my group, Diego hate the pizza. Uh, Diego, what is Diego? What is Diego? What is Diego? I don't see Diego. Diego? Where are you, Diego? Who is Diego? I don't see Diego here. Huh? can see him. Diego? Oh, really? Okay. I... Diego Arturo Gutierrez. <laughs> oh, maybe he left. Okay. Oh, yeah, I see here, Diego Arturo Gutierrez. Really, Diego, you don't like pizza? No, no pizza? Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I don't know, probably you hate chicken. I love chicken. Chicken is my favorite food. I can eat chicken every day. Indeed, every day I eat chicken. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. You know, I, I, <laughs> I make a joke to my wife. Um, I, I tell her, you know, at the end, I'm going to have feathers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, plumas, because <laughs> I eat chicken a lot. <laughs> yeah, of course. Okay, all right, good. So thank you for um, for playing. <laughs> that was a funny game, I guess. Okay, let's continue with uh, today's topic. Okay, so before uh, we go, I would like you to tell me some sentences comparing a house and an apartment. For example, for me, I think a house is better than an apartment for me. It is. Okay, what yes. about you? I want to hear some sentences. Mm -hmm. Okay. In my opinion, yes, it's better uh, a house as an apartment. Okay. Because uh, in your house, you can have your uh, big garden. You can have a uh, tree for the I don't know, for mango, for papaya, and in apartment, <laughs> no, it's possible. <laughs> Thank you, Violeta. Thank you so much. But, but usually, houses are far to the city, and that's why I think... Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Okay, let's do something very interesting. I just had an idea. Okay, guys, only men, okay? Only men, okay? Men are going to say that an apartment is better than a house. Women, women are going to say that a house is better than an apartment. And you, give a, you, get, you need to give some reasons, okay? So, chicos, el apartamento es mejor. And you got to come up with ideas and explanations and try to mm, refuse a women's ideas that a house is better than an apartment. Okay? Yes. Ladies, why do you think a house is better than an apartment? And then a los chicos les voy a preguntar después, a los hombres, ¿por qué el apartamento es mejor que una casa? 
Mm -hmm. Think about some reasons why. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Women. Um, I think. Ah, Jennifer. I think the the houses are better than apartments because you can have pets in apartments. We usually you can to have a pet. Good point. Okay, ladies are winning. Ladies are winning. Chicos, refuten eso. Eso que acaba de decir. She says that a house is better because you can have pets. Mm -hmm. ¿Quién quiere contradecir eso, chicos? Mm -hmm. It depends of the apartment because there are apartments where you can have uh, pets. Okay. Maybe the space is is it's litter, but it's very comfort. Okay. Com com okay. Comfortable. Mm -hmm. Depend the, the rules in the apartment. Yeah. Sure. Um, I, I'm teacher. going to say, yes. to say it. Wait, 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 Joaquin. Wait, 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 Joaquin. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, in the big city apartment, uh, we have uh, a pet and one or two is very easy to, to, to me uh, grow, grow out. Okay. Grow out. Okay, thank you, Joaquin. Ladies, what do you think, ladies? Mm -hmm. I suppose that a house is more convenient to live than an, in an apartment, it, especially if, 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 if the house is uniflora, you know, uniflora, I mean. It, you not mean like two, one floor, one not floor two floors. Oh, okay. The okay. main one is, is two, two floor, floors. Okay. I okay, okay, two, I two floors. I like to change it. Four. Ah, okay. Okay, guys. Mm -hmm. uh, well, I think an apartment is better because it's more comfortable for a single person. Oh, turn it down for what? Uh huh, yeah, uh huh. Okay. Single person, yes, it is, of course. No. <laughs> okay. Okay. Las mujeres tienen que refutar toda idea que los hombres digan acerca de por qué el apartamento es mejor. Okay. <laughs> I have one. Okay. Yes, Adriana. But but, but if the family are... grows, don't have is don't have more spaces. <laughs> Okay, Adriana. The apartment is, is ideal for a single person, but, but a family is, is not good. Mayuri, but the apartment is more romantic. Oh. Ah, okay. <laughs> yes. Yeah, baby. <laughs> In the penthouse. Okay, so you say that an apartment is uh, better because it's more romantic? Uh huh. <laughs> oh, but yeah, it's, maybe, it's not it's easier teacher. to clean. <laughs> maybe, but if you want to to form a family, you can do it uh, in a in apartment, uh, especially if you want a big family. Oh, good point. Good point. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, but in an apartment, you can make a party. Uh, but <laughs> in the house too. No, and the time. Because the yes. rules. In the house, you will throw the. the... <laughs> And you and have a pool if you don't have one. Yes, definitely. Don't forget the... Uh, In the don't apartment? Forget now, don't forget now. Uh, don't... Um, don't... Don't have? Don't have a, a big family or extended family. Oh, okay. Okay, In so I wish... I wish but I could. We for can that continue. reason is, continue. for that reason is, is a apartment is comfortable with a bit, with a little family. But I have one. Yes, okay. it's only Adriana. little okay. family. Let's wait. Let's wait for Adriana because Adriana, is, Adriana <laughs> is trying to speak up. Adriana. Also, it's better because when I cast your spheres, of course, you still have the land to build again. In an apartment, do you have the? The, the land to build. That's reasonable. That's very reasonable. Okay. 
Okay, in since I'm the judge, I'm the judge, right? So may I, may I teacher? May I? Mm, uh, okay, may okay. I? The last one, the last one, Sandra. Mm -hmm. Yes. Well, there is a disadvantage in an apartment because you have uh, to go by an uh, a, a, a sensor. Or oh, an elevator, you mean? An elevator. elevator. Uh huh. Elevator. And what about when the when the uh, the the um, the fire? Uh, the the power. Power went off. Or the, goes out uh-huh goes away uh-huh and you don't have uh, any any um escaleras stairs stairs stairs, stairs to, to go up uh -huh. the mother family prefer <laughs> apartment because it's comfortable okay okay final decision since and i'm the judge okay Time is up, time is up, okay? Because we can continue the whole okay. class. And I guess um, what the final decision is that you both are right. You both are correct. You both Thank uh, you, teacher. were right. So everyone, everyone uh, won, let's say, because you were giving um, very, very specific examples. And let me tell you that I'm very happy that you that you were speaking and using the language to express your ideas. That's the, that's the main point of this course, so that you can feel comfortable to speak. And even if you were, you were not sure about what you were saying, but you were trying, and that's good. That's very good. Okay, congrats. Congrats for everyone. All right. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Uh, thank you, because uh, you were speaking. I was just listening and moderating what you were saying. All right. So. When we are talking about uh, evaluating and comparing, it's very important. Uh, as you can see, uh, what I have right here, I have some examples here. For example, comparisons with adjectives. Look at the examples here. Houses aren't as convenient as apartments. How would you translate this? ¿Cómo traducirían esto? The sentence. Mm -hmm. Las casas no son convenientes como los apartamentos. Las casas no son tan convenientes como los apartamentos. There you go. Yeah. Tan, eso es lo que nosotros decimos en español. Tan como, ¿sí? Tan como. Ajá. Houses aren't as convenient as apartments. Good. Look the other one. Houses are just yes. as convenient um, as apartments. How would you translate that? Just as. Just as. Mm -hmm. Houses are just as convenient as apartments. Uh, las casas son tan convenientes conveniente. como los apartamentos. Yeah, yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. So mismo. in English, okay. The thing is like in, Yeah, in Spanish, in Spanish, it doesn't make any sense. Son decimos, justamente las casas, tan ha, convenientes. Como right. So, in Spanish, we say like, las casas son tan, son tan convenientes como los apartamentos. But in English, when we are expressing ideas or we are comparing two things, two things, uh, and we add the word just, believe me, that it changes the meaning of the sentence. That means that both are convenient enough, both, okay? That means that mm. houses are just as convenient as apartments, okay? En español no tiene ningún sentido si le agregamos justamente o son tan. It doesn't make any sense. But in English, just by the fact that you add just, mm -hmm. that makes the sentence a little bit what? A little, I would say, kind of equal the living and the living in the house and living in an apartment both are convenient enough okay igual de conveniente exactly exactly mm. the same there is not inconvenient Only at all. yes okay those mm. are adjectives right i mean wait 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 those are adjectives okay right convenient what about with noun? See, I have nouns right here. See, it says, yes. 
Apartments have. Listen. Oye, oye, miren el verbo acá, por favor. Look. Ok. ¿Por qué llevo have? Because it's plural. Plural. Right? Apartments have just as many rooms as houses. Ok. Ok, look the other one. Apartments don't have as much privacy as houses. Okay, can anybody tell me why am I using much and why am I using many? Anyone? Mm -hmm. Eso es porque eh, la why? privacidad no es algo que se pueda contar como, la, como los cuartos. Oh, there you go. Remember, every time every time we use what we use many that means that i can use many with countable nouns okay y cada vez que use much is because it is what uncomfortable uncomfortable wow. okay i mean uncountable i'm sorry not uncomfortable uncountable 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 yes okay look at that example apartments have just as many rooms as houses. Apartments don't have as much privacy as houses. Sí? Ok. Si quitara yeah. privacy, ¿qué otro nombre me darían acá ustedes? Si quitara privacy. Apartments don't have as much what? Convenience. 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 Yes. Convenience. Convenience as houses. What else? Mm -hmm. Comfortable. Uh, mm, give me a noun that is uncountable. Spacious. What is it? Spacious. Yeah, spaces. Okay. Safe. Safe. Okay, what is it? Safe. Safe. Mm, apartments don't have that would be that would be safety 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 okay uh, let me type in the chat okay safety safe equal to adjective oi oi <laughs> okay safety safety it's a noun okay see uh, safe is seguro safety uh, as uh, as security seguridad. Seguridad o seguro. Seguridad. Okay. Seguridad, exactly. Security. Right. Okay, yes. All right. Okay, look at this example that I have here, and then I, I will need your help. Look here. Uh, my bedroom is as quiet yeah. as the living room. Okay? Think about, think about your house. Y háganme una oración con el, con el adjetivo quiet. Miren mi ejemplo acá. My bathroom is as quiet as the living room. So, mi, mi cuarto es tan silencioso o tan callado o tan tranquilo, tan quieto, tranquilo como la living room. Ok. So, Vayan al, vayan al chat, por favor, y escriban una oración utilizando el adjetivo quiet. Piensen en su casa, en alguna habitación de su casa, que sea quiet y compárenla. Puede, by the way, it could be positive and also it could be negative. Porque, por ejemplo, let's suppose that my kitchen, my bedroom isn't as quiet as the living room. What I'm saying is that the living room is very quiet, but my bedroom is very noisy. Okay? Let me see. Aquí hay una oración. My, my. Okay. Joaquin is still working. Okay. Hmm? <laughs> okay. And by the way, by I'm the way, to... okay, let me see. My bathroom is as quiet as the kitchen. Really? Okay, <laughs> Janet, my backyard is as quiet as, as my bedroom. Ricardo, my living room isn't 
quiet. Ok, en ese caso, Ricardo, no necesito then. Ok, ok. You can say my living room isn't as quiet as my bathroom. As. Lo que le hace falta a usted, Ricardo, es esto. Look, this one. As. <coughs> ¿Sí? Remember, I'm using here um, as, as. ¿Ok? ¿Ok? ¿Ven acá? Ok. Sí, sí, tengo as, as. ¿Sí? Y utilizo un adjetivo en medio. ¿Ok? So, for example, my bathroom is as quiet as the living room. ¿Ok? Vamos a ver aquí, vamos a ver las otras oraciones. My yard is a, as quiet as the diving, diving room, maybe dining room, dining room. Because the diving is when you go to swimming, you go swimming and then you are diving, okay? Underwater, all right? My room is as quiet as my garden. Thank you, Diego. In my case, my living room is as quiet as my bathroom. Nice. Christian, my bathroom isn't as quiet as my bathroom. Okay. Angel, uh, Giovanni, my living room isn't as quiet as my room. Angel, my yard is as quiet as the chicken, the kitchen room. Oh, wait, do you have a chicken room? A chicken like, quack, 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 quack. I mean, it might happen. Maybe you live in the countryside. <laughs> Posiblemente viva, viva en el campo sí, y tenga, y tenga um, digamos, como afuera un gallinero. It could be. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Ángel. Judith. Okay. My, my granny has chickens. Ah, sí, sí, what I'm saying. Yeah. Uh, yeah, same. Uh, en mi casa hay unos palos de jocote y, y las gallinas están. Que, 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 que. So, yeah. I mean, I'm from the countryside, so, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, Judith Sanchez, my living room is as quiet as my dining room. Okay, good. What I would like you to do is, check it out. Tengo tres oraciones aquí. The apartment, my office, my bathroom. Y si ven acá, tengo, ¿qué? Tengo mucho, I have many adjectives right here. Can you see it? ¿Lo pueden ver? Yes. Yes. Okay. What I would like you to do is, I would like you to tell me sentences or type. Pueden escribir oraciones y después decirlas. Uh, I want you to use sentences using this adjective. For example, vamos a agarrar el, el de, vamos a ver, vamos a ver. Um, okay, vamos a ver. <coughs> okay. Uh, let me share something right now with you. Okay. Okay. Can you see? Can you see now? Yes. Can you see my screen? Yes. yes. Okay, good. Yes. So let's suppose that I'm going to, voy a tomar un, un adjetivo. Vamos a ver. Okay. I'm going to get modern. Modern. Voy a utilizar modern aquí. Okay. Modern. Okay, mother. The apartment. Which one? I don't know. The apartment. The apartment. Is as modern as my house. See? See? Mm -hmm. The apartment is as modern. I took as an example the adjective modern. Okay? So now, in your case, Siéntase libre de utilizar cualquier adjetivo. ¿Ok? Ok, go right now. Escriban oraciones right now. Les voy a dar um, como alrededor de tres minutos para que escriban oraciones. Si pueden ver acá. I got the apartment, my office, my bathroom. ¿Ok? Is that clear? Yes. Yes? Clear. Ok, good. Thank you. Y por favor, si tienen una pregunta, la pueden hacer en español. There is not a big deal if you ask any question in Spanish. ¿Ok? Por favor, pregunten, pregunten. Now is the time that you are going to practice. I have a use qu uh, quiet. Quiet. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, okay. you can use quiet. You can use quiet. See? ¿Sí? Okay. Okay. Si tienen, I have, I mean, you have a lot of what? A lot of um, 
adjectives. Okay. So, los dejo tres minutos para que hagan oraciones. En, en tres minutos, we are back. Okay. En dos minutos estoy de regreso. Okay. Okay, sir. Finished. Any question? Questions? Okay. Okay, let's see. Um, let's see the examples on the chat. But if you have any in your notebook, it's all right. Okay. I'm gonna read right now the ones that are here in the chat, and then if you have it in a piece of paper. You can read it later, okay? Let me check the ones in the chat. Okay. Mm -hmm. My office is annoy as noisy. Re remember Angel, okay, Angel. Yeah. In this case, for example, if you say, my office is as noisy, como que? Como que más? For example, diga, mi oficina es tan bullista como Como que necesita algo más ahí. Como está comparando, está comparando. My office is yeah, as yeah, yeah. noisy mm -hmm. as what? As what? Mm -hmm. Excellent. Okay. okay. Thank you, Angel. Mm -hmm. The apartment is as expensive as a hospital. Okay. Okay. Um, all right. Let me see. The apartment, the apartment is as expensive as my house. Good. My office is as noisy as a plaza. Okay. The apartment is as modern as the hotel. My bathroom is as spacious as my living room. Good. My living room have as much. Hmm. Okay. Ricardo Mancilla. Ricardo, are you there? Ricardo? Sí, sí. Okay. If you see, if you if you see this part, can you see? Apartments, uh, when, when I use much and many, is because I'm using, I'm using what? I'm using nouns, okay, see? I'm using nouns. And your example, you say, my living room have as much noisy. Noisy es un adjetivo, okay? Noisy es un adjetivo, en vez de noisy, Usted puede utilizar un nombre, an uncountable noun, okay? So that would be, for example, my <coughs> living room has, and by the way, it's not have, but has. ¿Por qué has? Porque es el living room. Y está hablando solamente de una living room, okay? Is that clear? Uh, okay, okay. Thank okay. you. Thank you, Ricardo. Um, my office is as comfortable as the living room. Good. My bathroom is as comfortable as my sofa. Good. My pet is as dangerous as the snake. Really, Hawking? <laughs> okay. <laughs> my yes. office isn't as huge as your company's. Good, Sandra. Okay, Christian. My office is just it's just as small as my bathroom. Really? Or it's just an example. <laughs> my office is as comfortable as an as an apartment. Good. My office is as dark as the lobby. Good. Very good. Because of the time, I, I don't have enough time to read all the examples. 
but I can see that you got the idea, okay? Okay, good. Okay, the good thing is right now, let me see Onise, my office isn't as huge as my living room, okay? Marjorie, my neighborhood is as safe as a few, as few neighborhoods. Good, good, very good. All right, thank you so much. All right, uh, listen up. Because of the time, uh, I'm going to move on, but let me tell you that I'm very happy because now you know how to compare houses and apartments, okay? Se recuerda que al principio usted decía, oh, the house is better than, than, than an apartment. However, today, no solamente pueden decir eso. Now you can say a house <coughs> is as convenient as an apartment, see? Now you are building your language, okay? Okay, all right. So the next, uh, next slide, let me see. Okay, that was something that I was explaining before. Also, we use comparison with nouns, see? Privacy, privacy is an uncountable noun and rooms, rooms what? Rooms is a countable noun, okay? Look at the example. My bathroom do not have as many windows as the living room. See? Mi habitación doesn't... My, my, oh, my bad, my bad. There is a mistake right there. I'm sorry, my bad. Okay? Okay? Doesn't. Okay? Okay, my bathroom doesn't have... Doesn't have as many... ¿Por qué estoy utilizando many? Porque el nombre es que contable. Windows. Okay? Yeah, windows. Good. Si yo no tuviera windows, si yo tuviera un nombre no contable, I would be using much. 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 Okay. Remember, yeah. keep it in mind. If you have an countable mm -hmm. noun, you are going to use many. But if you have an, a non-countable noun, you will need to use much. Much. Yes. Okay. Vamos a ver. I don't think we had time to go um, over the example. Pero quiero que alguien me haga un ejemplo acá. The kitchen. Okay. Utilizando esto, chicos. Miren. Utilizando esto. Utilizando esto. Let me see. This. We already talked about this, okay? Ahora estamos trabajando con este, ¿sí? Okay? Okay. Um, the, the kitchen has the kitchen or, or doesn't have... Uh -huh. Does not have... The kitchen uh, doesn't have as much uh, spaces the, as the living room. Okay, good. There is a, only an observation over there, Janet. Oh, okay, my bad. Okay, wait, 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 wait. There is an observation over there, Janet, and it's that cuando estoy utilizando many and much, debo de utilizar un nombre. Okay. okay? Spacious is an adjective. Okay. So, in that case, would be space. Space. Because it's a noun, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. But good Thanks. example. Mm -hmm. Okay, what about my cousin's house? Mm -hmm. My cousin's house. ¿Cómo sería un ejemplo con, um, siguiendo este, este patrón que está acá? My bathroom doesn't have as many windows as the living room. My cousin's house. Uh -huh. My cousin's house. Does not have as many Apartment as my cousin's house uh, doesn't have as many uh, rooms as many rooms as, as many rooms as as a uh, as a hotel probably mm -hmm. yeah okay good good thank you thank you so much okay and the last one my neighbors. Front yard, think about flowers. Piensen acerca de las flores. My neighbors, mm -hmm. 
My, my neighbor's, neighbor's front yard uh -huh. doesn't have many flowers. Have oh, uh -huh. keep, keep going, keep as, going. Mm -hmm. As my yard. Oh, good. My neighbor's front yard doesn't have as, doesn't have as many flowers as my yard. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. All right. Okay. Um, tomorrow we're going to continue with the topic tomorrow. And remember that tomorrow we're going to be starting also another topic. And it's uh, I wish. I wish I could. I wish I didn't. I wish. I wish. I wish. Okay. So thank you so much. And today, now you know how to compare what? Compare houses and an apartment and how to say which one is better and why. Okay, so do you have any question? Any question? Uh, no, teacher. No, oh, yeah. Yeah. Time is over, teacher. Time is you? over. Time is yeah. over. Time yes, is over Giovanni? Giovanni? Yes, sir. Do you have any question? Uh, no, I don't have any question. Thank you. Okay, thank you for showing up. So I will see you tomorrow, okay? Have a great night. <laughs> Great night. Bye-bye. 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 Bye-bye.